green is showing that output is coming from this and as I rotate the knob voltage vary accordingly. So friends, after connecting the components in the PCB, I have got the board of such type and I have got a case of the old converter like this. This was the DC to AC converter 45 watts. So I will assemble all these components into this and uh, for this we need a hole to assemble this on off switch so we have to drill over here and uh, for this regulator I have to make a drill over here and uh, for this digital voltmeter I think that this space will be sufficient so I have cut an aluminium sheet like this and I will assemble in this manner and uh, put the voltmeter over here and there is no need for this point of the LED and uh, this uh, this point will be LED for the main supply and this point for the output supply and uh, some more drill needed to assemble this transformer like this and uh, there must be a uh, space for the fuse or power supply and uh, if we use this for the power supply we have to make a drill for the fuse this is the electrical appliance so be careful assemble all these parts in a proper manner so see what can I do So we have to drill these points 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. So the work of drill so the work of drilling the hole has almost been completed. Here are the for the transformer, this is for the fuse and this is for the on off switch, this is for the digital voltmeter and this is for the volume or tone to up or down voltage by rotating the switch. Since this cabinet is uh, old and not looking good, so I have to decorate it with the sheet with the laptop's back cover, it's a 3D sheet. Let us cut it and design your variable voltage supply with this.
Okay, this is looking like this. This is the output and this is the power cable. Now I am inserting the power cable and testing it and switching it on. Yes, this is main power supply that AC input is coming into the transformer and this green is showing that output is coming from this and as I rotate the knob voltage vary accordingly ok now let us check it from the multimeter ok I have assigned the voltage at 200 volt in the I have ordered 3 digital voltmeter from the eBay and uh, the result of every digital voltmeter is varying accordingly somewhat so I am just slowly slowly I am rotating the knob of the volume or you can say I am adjusting the power voltage now this is giving 1.2 volt approximately but uh, the digital voltmeter which I have got online from eBay does not evaluate less than 3.1 volt as I rotate the voltage as it goes to 3 volts display is coming on the digital voltmeter and slowly and gradually you can increase the desired voltage so the maximum voltage we get is approximately 30 32 volts DC so friends this was all about variable voltage power supply when the resources is not available properly and we have to adjust the things and we have to make the design so this is the this is one of the example of that so if you like this video then please click on like button friends I am in need of the like button so please click like button and if you like this video then please share and subscribe innovative ideas thanks for watching thank you